understanding. So right now I am not able to see any response. Hello, hello. Right, you right. Can hear. Yes, yes. There must be a central idea when we start to create a concept map or a mind map also. We must have one idea. Any other wants to share the response? Uh, you can write a response in the chat box. Yes, mind map, whenever we create mind map, we brainstorm the ideas, right? Concept will give clear idea about the topic. Okay. Yes, another response from uh, Rekha ma'am, that mind maps connect with central idea, even in a concept map also, there must be a central idea. So, uh, I can come to a definition that whenever we create a mind map uh, with your responses, keeping in mind what whatever you are responding uh, to this query in the chat box, that whenever we create a mind map, we have uh, we must have one central idea, which we break into sub ideas to clarify any topic to our students or wherever uh, we are explaining the topic. So let's begin with the, the presentation. Give me a few seconds. I'll share my screen. And it is showing, uh, the admins there, it is showing that my screen sharing is disabled. Kindly allow me. I'm it's enabled. Now you can share the screen. Okay, thank you. Uh, Alok, my the system is getting restarted, so I'm not able to share the screen. I'm really sorry. Yeah, you have to wait for a few minutes. Or else, if you are having my presentation, Alok? Uh, Ma'am, where can I assess your presentation? I'll share it with you. Just wait. Okay.
Uh, till the time ma'am is connecting, reconnecting, I would like to again reiterate that uh, please rename the here the person coming as a red me. Please rename themselves. I would like to inform all, all the participants that we verify. We verify all the participants who, who is joined with the attendance. So if you join with other name every time in every session, we won't be able to verify you and will certify you at the end of the workshop because a percentage of based on a percentage of attendance, we will give the certificates to the participant. So be careful. Ma'am, there is small request. Yes, sir. Ma'am, about the assignment, uh, uh, you are uh, told about the OER certificate. Yes. And when we are registering in the website, we are not getting the verification email. Uh, so we can't unable to um, register in the website, ma'am. Can't log in that. Okay. So we didn't get the verification email, so. I would request other participant to clarify him. Uh, Rajesh, Rajesh ji, I can help you with this. Yeah. So when, when you start registering and you don't get the verification email, simply at that very time without changing the page, mm -hmm. click on the link, uh, the link which we have given, paste the link again in the bar, address bar, and then enter and you will find yourself logged in. Okay, sure, ma'am. We'll try. Okay. Yes, you can try. This is working. Uh, this was identified by one of the participants that sometimes we are uh, prone to not receiving a verification mail. So when you don't receive and you are on the same page, just paste the link which we have given again in the browser. Enter and you will find yourself, your name on the top of the screen right part that you are already logged in. Okay, okay, okay. Hello. Excuse yes, me. Yes, sir. 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 Yes, नहीं ये पासवर्ड मैम मैम या या यंचन मैम एक यंचन मैम वन सेकंड वन सेकंड लेट मी कंप्लीट द क्वेरी ऑफ मिस्टर लोटोस एंड देन वी कम बैक टू यू यस सर प्लीज कंटिन्यू वी कैन नॉट कंप्लीट इट बिकॉज़ देर इस यू नो uh, the correct password and then you can uh, do it otherwise as i explained the login process the registration process if you are not receiving the verification mail you can oh, simply it. after registering you can simply paste the actual link given by us again in the uh, the top field and you will find yourself logged in and you can start the course and don't confuse it you have to just complete the course and earn a certificate then we will tell you how to go forward and the course will not, uh, the course you can continue, uh, you can complete till any day of the training. It will not get closed. Only thing you have to submit the certificate in assignment. We will close the okay. assignment once we In the five start. days. Yes. So you have time. You please uh, uh, try to complete it during that time. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So now, uh, Dr. Pulchin has already joined once yeah, again. So ma'am, over to you for the session. Good, Thank you, Monika, ma'am. And uh, sorry for the inconvenience. Uh, in, uh, I just disconnected from uh, this uh, session. So we were discussing about concepts and uh, I have received many uh, uh, responses uh, regarding the question, uh, what is the meaning of concept? What do you understand? So you have uh, told that it is it has some central idea. Whenever we create a, a mind map, we must have a central idea. Uh, to which we explain, we further uh, bifurcate that uh, central idea into many sub ideas, and then we create a concept map with the help of those sub topics and uh, explain to our students. So let's start with the PPT. Uh, what is the meaning of concept? Concept. 
concepts as we know these are defined as the abstract ideas the mind map uh, whenever we create the concept maps and mind maps we uh, there must be any abstract idea which we need to explain to our students uh, in a very simpler way so uh, it must have uh, any abstract idea or the general no notions which occurs in our mind in, a, in the speech or in the thoughts. Uh, those concepts we, which we cannot explain easily to students or to other persons, we take the help of concept maps and we, uh, we explain those abstract ideas and those concepts maps in a very simple way to the uh, stakeholders or the to the person uh, to whom which we are explaining that topic. So uh, we can say that concepts are understood as the fundamental building blocks, ideas, beliefs, uh, and thoughts. There are many uh, many abstract uh, concepts, many abstract ideas, some of which I have mentioned in this slide, such as uh, bravery. Bravery, if you want to uh, make another person understand what is the meaning of uh, bravery, you always uh, just uh, make them listen to the stories based on the braveries or the brave person, some brave, uh, the, some characters uh, who were brave. And uh, you just told them the stories based on uh, those personalities. But if we make the audience understand what is the meaning of bravery, then we take this term as the main concept and then we can take the related words which are related to bravery and make a mind map based on this concept or this abstract idea. There are uh, other ideas, that there may be other ideas also uh, like if we make another person understand about the different dance forms then uh, again we can uh, take help of the concept maps and happiness is also another uh, abstract idea it is a feeling which sometimes we cannot explain what is happiness and uh, why we are happy what what we call happiness so if we want to understand such topics such ideas to audience to uh, our uh, students uh, in the classroom then we can take off uh, take help of concept maps and the mind maps So here is an example of a uh, concept map, which uh, I have shown in my slide. Uh, in this slide, you can see, uh, I have tried to explain how climatic changes occurs. So just to explain this concept, because it is again an, uh, an abstract concept, if I want to explain what are climatic changes and why uh, uh, climatic uh, changes occurs and what are the causes of uh, these uh, climatic changes and how we can solve this problem, then uh, we can draw a mind map. And whenever we draw a mind map, we must have uh, two components. There are two components uh, uh, which are uh, very important to create a mind map. First one is the main idea, which we depict with the help of uh, a square or a rectangle or a circle, there uh, can be any shape through which we can depict the central idea. And <clears throat> with the help of arrows, we connect the sub ideas. So as you can see in this concept map, there's an example of this concept map, you can see the central idea is climatic changes, which we are dividing into three sub concept. First one is evidence, the top one, and on the right side, you can see the causes, which again, uh, we have divided into two sub concepts. The causes may be human activities and the natural environmental changes. Again, uh, the downward arrow <coughs> shows the solutions, how we can uh, recover the climatic changes and what could be the possible solutions uh, uh, through which we can overcome this problem. So one could be, as you can see, the uh, find, uh, the mind map is progressing with the help of these arrow lines and the sub-concepts. 
so one solution could be change in human behavior which it is further divided into two uh, solutions and which are depicted with the help of this uh, <clears throat> cloud shape uh, box uh the human behavior could be explore renewable uh, energy sources reduce burning of fossil fuels so uh, in this way you can see how we are dividing the main concept into sub concepts and we are further dividing that that, that sub concept into other sub sub concepts so as we have discussed and you already know that uh, for creating a concept map there are two main things uh, first one is concept which we are uh, which you will be explaining and <clears throat> the relationship lines which uh, can be depicted with the help of arrows and we also call these arrows as cross links here is an again an, an example of concept map let's go to the next slide some types of concept maps i have uh, uh, i have tried to show uh, in this slide a concept map could be of any shape it could be in the shape of spider map and uh, in the spider map you can see uh, our concept map progresses in the shape of a spider as uh, the spider has many legs uh, and uh, one uh, main body Uh, similarly, in this spider spider map, uh, the, there must be a concept. Uh, there must be a main concept which uh, further divides into into the uh, sub sub concepts. And again, a concept map could be in the shape of flow chart. It could be in the shape of hierarchy. It could be a systematic uh, systemic map. so there uh, whatever tool you are using for creating mind maps and concept maps there uh, must be many uh, examples of slides there must be uh, many shapes available in that tool and you can find out the shapes in that particular tool or if you are using any app then you can find these shapes the shape of uh, the types of shapes uh, in that particular app so there is a common question uh, which usually arises what is the difference between mind map and concept map so here is a picture which shows the difference between mind map and concept map i request you all to just observe this picture first and then we can discuss about it to so just see this picture please as you can see in the concept map there can be many concepts which there could be many sub concept which you further explain and which you can further uh, 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 you can further uh, expand to explain that particular topic to your students but in mind map there is one concept which as you have already responded that uh, you have to create this uh, mind map you can create this uh, the mind map map with the help uh, with by brainstorming yourself so you have to brainstorm yourself uh, whenever you create a mind map to understand that concept better but in concept map there could be more than one concept here are some online concept mapping tools which you can explore uh, and these are google.us poplet mindmap creately google lucid chart mindmeister mindomo spider scribe and there are many more online concept mapping tools i have mentioned only few <laughs> 
Some free and open source concept mapping tools are also available. For example, free mind and draw mind map, Dossia, visual and understanding free. environment. Ma'am, are in the previous ones, uh, the free ones? Yes, these are ma'am, bubble.us, pop. There are many, many, many concept mapping tools on the, which are available online. Are, aren't mentioned. these free, I think, as you haven't mentioned? Yes, the free I have mentioned in the uh, next slide. Right, right, ma'am. Thank you. So the fourth one is visual understanding environment, which uh, we will do it, uh, today. And uh, next one is free plane, Coggle, XMind, Wise Mapping, Mind for 2, 3D. There are many more. <clears throat> so what is the use of concept mapping? Why do we use this concept mapping in classroom? With the help of concept mapping, as we all know, uh, we can make our learner an active learner, not a passive learner. Because uh, in creating mind maps or in creating concept map, we can include the response of each and every student. We, inclu we can include every student of our class uh, and we can take their views, their ideas, uh, their thoughts to create the mind map so that the topic could be divided into much simpler way so that it could be uh, easier for every student to understand that uh, particular concept. And also students can organize their knowledge, what, uh, what uh, they are thinking uh, and uh, they can uh, use their knowledge in that uh, mind map, whatever you are creating. <clears throat> Obviously, students can learn with better vision. It helps the students see the big picture. In this slide, I have shown uh, the comparison of top mind mapping tools, comparison in the terms of platform in, on which you can run that uh, mind mapping tool and the use of that uh, mind mapping tool and the extension of files. So you can have a look on it only. So these are two slides. And the purpose of showing this slide is that you can identify uh, that which tool is suitable for <clears throat> your this operating system. Maybe some of you are using Windows operating system. Uh, some of you may be using Mac, Linux, or Android-based uh, mobile phones. So now let's come to our tool, Visual Understanding Environment. It is an open source project, and it's, it is developed by the Academic Technology Group at Tufts University. And, uh, also, it has a feature of creating creating mind map and charts, and you can <clears throat> easily format the mind map. Uh, there are many features available in this tool uh, with the help of which you can uh, modify, you can format your mind map and make it more attractive and uh, uh, more simplify. You can uh, you can simplify your concept map. So visual understanding environment is an application for concept and content mapping for students, academicians, CEOs, managers, and writers that provide a simple yet powerful tool. So here I just want to uh, <clears throat> say that it is not only for the academicians, any person, uh, be it the CEOs or the managers or the authors and the writers, they can also use the concept mapping tools. And whenever you uh, present your content, your concept in uh, with the help of concept mapping tool, it shows that you have organized each and every information in that concept mapping tool. And uh, the concept map which we create, it is obviously <clears throat> uh, in a non-linear way. They are they have not created in a linear way. They are non-linear because they are they could be in any shape. And uh, we use uh, uh, we use uh, the connecting lines uh, 
so whenever we use the connecting lines we can uh, break that the any main topic into sub topics obviously then uh, it can not go in a linear manner so these things we have already dis discussed so i am not uh, taking this slide and <clears throat> so let's discuss the feature of visual understanding environment it allows presenter to create annotated trails through their maps yes of course because we used many relationship lines we use many connecting lines to uh, so the information is in is available in expandable manner it is not going in into a linear way and the pathway feature also provides a slide view of information on the map slide mode lets the presentation toggle between map view and slide view you can create many slides of a concept map in uh, this visual understanding environment and whenever <clears throat> you uh, want to show uh, you want to see your concept maps in a slide uh, slide view you can do that also again a visual understanding environment as we have discussed earlier it uh, could be uh, used by anyone uh, who is interested in uh, visual structuring of digital content so this is the very first screen whenever you want to download this uh, application into your laptop or into your pcs you will get this screen <coughs> so here are the versions which are available uh, for downloading you can select the suitable version and after selecting you can uh, you will get this dialog box and uh, here in dialog box this dialog box you have to click on the run button to download all the <coughs> files into your pc or your laptops <coughs> and uh, this picture shows the extraction of files and after downloading this application you will get this empty map screen where, where you can create your concept map so now let's begin with the hands on if you are not having this application into your laptop or into your pc you can please download it immediately so that we can go uh for the hands on session i'm sharing uh, my screen again Tell me if you are having any question, any doubt, you can write in the chat box. I'll show you how you can download this application into your uh, laptops. So uh, I hope my screen is visible to you all. Simply, you have to open the Google Chrome and. type visual understanding environment
the very first link here you can notice that uh, it is written uh, view.turfs.edu is it visible to all just click yes, on the very first link yes, the same page which i have shown you it uh, is appearing here it is asking to you for the compatible version So because I am using Windows uh, operating system, I'll, I'll download this version. Just click on the view installer. All the files are getting stacked. So now you can see the files are extracting and you will get the empty map screen. <clears throat> Ma'am, what about word web? Is that the synonym of uh, this concept map or mind map? Uh, word web is also used by some of the people. Yeah, worldwide. Yeah. Word, word web, it is word web. So world web, I am not getting this thing. I'll yeah, check or if uh, if uh, you can message it uh, in the group. I'll yeah, check. Um, it's only related to vocabulary, only words, not okay. the concepts. Okay. So now you can see we have got our working area. This is the empty map screen. Here you can create the mind map. So let's start. I'll just explain you what uh, what is there in this um, uh, is this web page. You can see the top most uh, in yeah, this bar. This is the menu bar. It is same uh, as we find it uh, in any other application. Uh, under the file menu, you can get the new open open URL, uh, etc. There is edit menu, view menu, format menu, content, pathways, analysis. This is the menu bar and uh, below this, uh, we have the drawing toolbar. With the help of this drawing toolbar, we can uh, we will create our mind map. So the first tool, this uh, which uh, you can see, this arrow button, it is the selection tool. Whenever you bring your cursor- Screen is not showing, ma'am. Uh, ma'am, your slide is not moving, ma'am. Uh, it is not a slide, but uh, it is the uh, uh, the working area of this uh, visual understanding environment. If uh, my it's, screen is not visible to you, no, 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 no. I think you have shared only the. Then I'll, I'll, okay, I'll share it again, sir. Yeah, And now is it visible? Yes, ma'am. Okay, thank you. Hello. Yes, ma'am. So I was telling that uh, on the top you can get the uh, menu bar, and under this <clears throat> you can get the drawing tool bar. So uh, in the drawing tool bar, the very first tool uh, which is shown in the form of arrow, it is the selection tool with the help of this tool. You can select any node, any uh, this relationship uh, ship line or uh, your uh, whole concept map also, you can select with the help of this tool. The next drawing tool is the node tool. This node tool draws the main idea where we can write uh, the main concept. And with the help of the same tool, we can also draw 
the sub concepts also here uh, into this uh, box we can write the topic and the subtopics now i'm deleting this uh, another box it the third drawing tool it is the linking tool with the help of which we can draw the linking lines in the shape of arrow this is the rapid prototyping tool and with the help of this tool you can draw two boxes and you can also get a linking line which connects these two boxes so if you want to draw one box you can take help of the second tool the node tool but if you want to draw the sub concepts and you want to get two boxes and uh, with the uh, with the linking line you can take the help of this fourth option the rapid prototyping tool this uh, fifth button is a text tool with the help of this tool you can add text to your concept map and the another tool is zoom tool uh, the this hand type of tool is the move canvas to tool uh, and with the help of which you can move the whole canvas uh, uh, which you have drawn and the last button it is the playback slides as i have told that we can create many slides of uh, concept maps and we can run these slides so uh, this is the playback button for uh, running and for playing the these slides so let's start with the how we can create any concept map so create for creating a concept map we must have a central idea today we will draw the concept map based on pollution because here in delhi the pollution level is little high so i am taking uh, the prevalent problem under the windows menu we can get the formatting palette so firstly i want to i just want to change the color of this node i want to make it white only so that it could be easily visible to you all pollution could be of any type so uh, we know there are many type of pollution could you please tell the types of pollution air pollution sound pollution water pollution yes with the help of this third tool air pollution water pollution yes so you can see whenever i'm uh, drawing this uh, arrow line a uh, box is coming automatically with this arrow line we can delete this box by clicking our cursor anywhere on the screen okay so i have divided this main concept into two concepts what could be the causes of air pollution industries transport smoke from industries vehicles vehicles
So now we will write the causes of air pollution. You can move your box with the help of this uh, uh, up, down, left, and right arrow, which are available on the keyboard. How can we delete this node, ma'am? Unless I uh, After selecting, you can just uh, press the delete button from your keyboard. You have to select the particular node and then you can press the delete button. Causes could be natural, it could be natural human one, activities yes and it could be uh, the use of machines now we will write inside the boxes natural cause human activities use of machines. Now we can connect these boxes with the help of linking lines. Now I think it is making sense and it is clear also how uh, the topic is going on. Now we extend this, uh, the mind maps and mind map by writing more subconcepts by adding more subconcepts to human activities. So what would be the human activities? It could be Household waste. Household waste. Household waste. Oh, yes, household waste. Okay. Okay, household waste. Industries. Cooking. Yes, industries. Deforestation. Vehicle. Deforestation. Oh, very good. Vehicle. Deforestation, very good. Vehicle, there could be many more. So we are taking only these four. Now we will connect these subconcepts, sub subconcepts, with the subconcept human activity. You can draw it in, in the hierarchical manner also. Then it would be more clear. So uh, you can expand your mind map by adding more sub sub concepts. It is an example only here. Now I can, uh, I'll show you how you will format your mind map. Okay. So as you can see this picture, which we have created, we cannot identify what is the main concept and uh, which are the sub concepts. 
So now you can edit your mind map with the help of drawing tools. The pollution, the word pollution, it is the main concept. Okay. So let's select this main concept and then go to the win Windows menu. Under this Windows menu, you will find the formatting palette. And in this formatting palette, you can find the option of fill, uh, which means the filling uh, of, of color. So you can take any color of your choice through which you want to make others understand what is the main concept. So we have taken this color for the sub concepts. We will select these two sub concepts. And then we again take a color which could be different from the main concept. The causes we are, because we are explaining the causes of uh, air pollution, we will take the similar color which we have taken for air pollution. <coughs> Okay. So, the one of the causes human activities, we can show this with another color and the similar sub concepts which are related to human activities, we can show in the same color so that it could be easier for others to understand what are the related sub sub concepts i hope i am clear to you all and again the causes we have defined uh, we have written natural cause human activities and machines so these are three different causes so we will take some other color for these two causes the natural cause and the use of machines. In the similar way, you can extend your concept map as per your need. So this is how you can change the color of nodes. You can also change the color of the relationship lines or the arrows in the similar manner. You have to select these lines and then you can take the color of your choice. Now you can see all the relationship lines are uh, have become in red color. And also here, just to make others understand what is the main concept, <clears throat> you can change the shape of the nodes also. Here are many shapes are available, rectangular, oval, in the rhombus shape and there are many more shapes you can take any shape of your choice you can also change your relationship lines into curved lines whenever there is a need if you want to show a relationship into a curved line then you can curve your uh, this, these arrow lines here are many shapes are available, three, three shapes. Uh, this, uh, I think you can see these shapes. The curved lines are also available there, there. So you can curve your relationship lines as per your need. And also there are many formatting tools which you are familiar with. There is, uh, you can change the uh, font of your text, you can change the style of your text, you can change the size of the text. So these are very common features with the help of which you can format your mind map. So another important thing which uh, we want to discuss with you that in this, uh, in this mind map, in this concept map, you can add pictures also and you can add the links also. Link for the content you want to share with your students. 
For example, here under the causes, we have shown that there are natural causes of pollution, air pollution, there are uh, human activities also, there are uh, the uh, use of machine is another cause. So if you want to add any picture related to this concept, you can add by clicking, by right clicking on this node, just select the node and right click here on it. A menu bar will appear. Here in this menu bar, you can see add image or file option. You have to click on it. And you have to go the location wherever you have saved that picture. Right now, I'm not having any picture. So uh, I'm not selecting any. But I suggest you to first save the pictures related to your concept, related to your sub concept, and then add it as per the need. You can also add the URL. Suppose you want to add, uh, you want to add uh, uh, more content to your mind map because here we have limitations of writing text. In this uh, small box, you can not add a long information. Then uh, you want to share some additional information with your students. Then you can add the URL of that content. And whenever you can add the URL here, and whenever uh, you click on this box, it will redirect you to that particular web page, uh, which you have uh, the URL of which you have added here. Okay. So I now request you all to create your mind maps according to your subject, the subject which you are teaching and share it with us. And I am here with you uh, in this session. Wherever you feel any problem, any uh, doubt, you can ask. Ma'am, do we have any redo and do options? Uh, it is, these are the same options which we normally use control Z. You have to how press to from open your... a smart mobile? Pardon, sir? How to open in our smart mobile? You cannot, uh, no, sir. You cannot create concept map in visual understanding environment with the uh, with in with your uh, smartphone. It is not an application. It is a tool which you can only access in your laptop or your PC. View you cannot find in your mobile as an application here. Yeah. Ma'am, I'm finding okay. difficult to install for MacBook. Can you please help me? Sir, when uh, you, whenever you are downloading this version, uh, I showed it to you. There, there uh, were two options. One is uh, for Windows and another one uh, was for Mac. You can choose the Mac version. For yeah, that's what, that, that's what I have downloaded for Mac version itself, but I'm finding mm -hmm. error message. Achha, what uh, error error is I'm, I'm not getting. Can you please share your screen or uh, you can uh, take the screenshot and uh, share in the group also, Sanji group, so that I can understand what you are asking, sir. Yeah. Actually, it's asking for JavaScript. Uh, so it's asking Do you have Java, Java installed in your PC, sir? Yeah, I tried installing Java also, but still... You try it once, sir. If you face any problem, uh, then uh, I'll try to help. In meanwhile, we can take other questions also. It's it's also asking for uh, uh, of buying the WinRAR license. It seems. And then you just Something cross like that. that option, ma'am. Uh huh. Uh, during this question answer session, ma'am, can I just intervene for a minute? Yes, sure, ma'am. Uh, so everyone, please mark your attendance because not everybody has marked it till now. And 
marking of attendance is mandatory for both forenoon and afternoon session without your attendance we will not be able to later on issue the relieving orders if we don't find the attendance and for yesterday if anybody has missed the attendance we won't be now allowed you won't be allowed to mark we have taken the screenshots of zoom participant list we will match from there if you were present in the meeting we will mark but again for that you should have written your name with state code then only we will be able to identify and mark for your attendance so for attendance please be extra careful it is mandatory and you have to mark all the attendances uh, whenever they are posted so don't miss on that it is still open because i saw a lot of participant have not marked it yet we are keeping it open for another 10 minutes after that we will close for this session and we won't allow anybody to mark the attendance later it is a mandatory task please mark your attendance and also rename yourself appropriately so that later on if we don't find attendance sheet then we can match it from there but it is always better to mark in the google form for safer side for your uh, benefit uh, thank you ma'am and now yeah. if you have any questions Uh, ma'am there is a question in the chat box please yes, inform yes. how to change color of words and shapes mm -hmm. yes yes i am reading these questions only uh, there is one more query uh, i want to respond to that first so someone has asked if we can add audio in the mind map so sir uh, there is no such option of adding audios in the mind map but obviously you can try adding the link of that audio into the node so uh, another query is of uh, changing the color uh, which i have already discussed that sir you can uh, go to the windows menu and under windows menu you will find the formatting palette through this formatting palette you can format your the colors uh, you, uh, you can change the colors and you can change the shape also how to fill color in text box again uh, you have to go to the format formatting palette sri lata vakula ma'am uh, yes ma'am there are many options which are available in that uh, formatting palette you can choose according to your need ma'am whatever you want to do the formatting you are doing you know better you can choose the option as per your need or else if you are having any problem you can uh, uh, share your screen with us yes we can you can uh, bold the linking lines by selecting those lines and then again go to the bold option in the formatting palette and the linking lines will get bold ma'am same issue i am unable to install this application in macbook okay sir sir did you share that your screenshot or the issue which you are facing just a second Yeah, I have shared, madam. Please check. Sir, can you share your screen, Madhu sir? Yeah, it's asking for. Uh, Acha, please allow Madhu sir to share the screen. I have enabled ma'am screen share. Thank you, screen. thank you.
Till then, uh, all the participants can uh, create their mind maps and uh, we will discuss it here only. Yes. Can you see now, madam? Yes, sir. Yeah, this is the error I'm getting. So, sir, I think you have to update the Java version. Yeah, that's what I tried no, to install no. many Java versions. But uh, even I tried downloading Java. It should be later than 1.6, right? That you have to check, sir. Not supporting. So you first try downloading the appropriate Java version for your MacBook. Yeah, I just downloaded and tried installing. I have installed this is Java, right? Uh, sir, also, if it does not work, is the, like after installing properly, once it is installed, you can restart your computer also once again. Because sometime once we install also, uh, the JavaScript creates a problem, then you can re, uh, hmm. up, uh, update, uh, I mean, basically restart the system and then check again. Okay, okay, well, I'll do that. I'll just uh, exit from this and then I'll rejoin. Right. Okay, thank you, sir. Okay, okay. So changing the color of nodes. Emma, I'll again share one. my screen and then explain you how you can change the color of your nodes and nodes. Of um, I have created one. Uh, by the time ma'am is explaining this answer and sharing the screen, I must inform you here that whatever output ma'am has told you to take, say for example, as a PDF or JPEG, that is an image format, Please create a proper concept map because this can be submitted as one of your assignment later on. So you can please be focused and do practice on the software's applications which are being uh, told here so that you can create your infographic or you can create your concept map both for both the sessions I'm saying, which can be later on submitted as an assignment for your training. Please continue. Okay, thank you ma'am. So like uh, if you want to change the color of a node, firstly, you have to select that node. You can select the node by simply clicking on that node or you can select the node with the help of this arrow button, this selection tool. So after selecting, just click on this node. After selecting, uh, you have to go to the Windows menu. And under the Windows menu, you will find the formatting palette. And in this formatting palette, you will get this option of fill color. And you can change any color of your choice with the help of this option. Okay. And for changing the color of lines you have to select these connecting lines again you have to go to the line option under formatting palette and then take the color of your choice do we have to do it individually ma'am or can we select all at once yes, for example can, for bolding huh? you can select the whole mind map also and you can uh, select the uh, select each node also but as uh, I have told you that uh, we want to explain, uh, we want to show what is the main concept and what uh, what are the sub concepts. Uh, that's why we have taken different colors for uh, each node. Yeah, yeah. In order so to if you want the... to select, uh, if you want yeah. to select the whole uh, concept map, then uh, you can just go to this uh, selection tool and drag this tool to uh, on the whole concept map, and it right, will get selected. Fonts. 
yeah font size of all the letters of all okay. the names okay then uh, just uh, uh, go to this bold option below this text uh, uh, font style uh, you can also change the font style by default it is coming in arial and uh, you can select the uh, font type of your choice and you can make the letters bold with the help of this b uh, normally uh, how we do uh, how we make the bold uh, the letters bold it is in the same manner okay is it clear ma'am yes ma'am you can change the color of the text also simply you have to select the text and this is style button here under this style button you will find the colors you can change the text uh, color of the text also any other question uh, acha you want to show your uh, my concept map the symbols underneath this ma'am the this uh, video lines? symbol it seems. no here uh, on the top left Achha, this one, this, uh, uh, this, yes, uh, I've told you that if you create uh, many layers of mind maps, mm -hmm. then you can uh, play these layers with the help of this button. And the hand. Right now we have the hand is uh, the, this move canvas, move canvas tool. Okay. Achha, achha. Yes. Ma'am, same issue even after restarting the system. Okay. Uh, I'll check afterwards. I do hardware and networking. I need some time for this. I'll check it later. I can't do it right now. What to do? Is it okay if I do it later? Yes, sir. Ma'am? Uh, so, ma'am, uh, there is a ma stop showing the mind map. Monica, ma'am, can we take any uh, mind map drawn by the participants? Yes, sure, we can. Uh, 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 I'll request Mr. Alok to please uh, give the permission who raises the hand. So for uh, just from the discipline point of view and taking all the maps, you can raise the hands one by one. We can see the maps of those participants. Don't speak in between. If you have any question, you can put in the chat box also. Uh, from Pondicherry, Jagdeshwari, and please show your mind. Jagdishwari, ma'am, you are given the permission, please. If you want to add text in Hindi language, there is one query. Uh, then uh, you can try the Google input tool. And from there, you can uh, copy the text and add into the mind map. Just try it once, sir. Jagdishwari, ma'am, you have raised the hand. Please show your mm -hmm. map if you want to. Ma'am, uh, how to show, ma'am? Uh, click on the buttons, share screen. Yes, ma'am. Once you click on the button, select the screen which you want to show here. Okay. And then, okay. And then we will be able to see. Okay, ma'am. Ma'am, I have shared a uh, pic of my mind map. Please have a look. Okay, sir. Now you can go to the screen, ma'am, whatever on which you have worked. Ma'am, is it seen, ma'am? I could see the mobile device screen. You have to open the application also. After you share the screen, then you open the application. Then we will be able to see. Okay, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. Once again, you can try. No Ma'am, uh, somebody else can do, ma'am. Okay, fine. Right. No issues. You can take a screenshot and send to us. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, there is this Harsha Holivana from Karnataka, I think. I'll share the screen and uh, show for him.
Uh, Gulshan ma'am, you can now have a look. This has been created by one of the participants. It has been shared in the WhatsApp. Oh, sorry, in the chat. Oh, hmm. Sir, have you created this right now? The same question I wanted to ask. Uh, madam, this is textbook ke content, hai, madam. Abhi na ek padhya hai. Sir, this map you have made now? No, no, I have made it before. Which tools are you? Madam, this is made on PPT, madam. Because you know that it is not made from this tool. Se <laughs> नहीं नहीं मैडम अभी हम न्यू अवेयर है इसमें ओके okay. सर ऐसा है कि मैं सभी से अनुरोध रिक्वेस्ट करूंगी कि जो इस सेशन के आउटपुट है वो दिखाएं आपका पुराना काम हम इस वक्त यहां नहीं देख पाएंगे तो हम बाद में देख सकते हैं तो आप यहां पे जो आपने इस सेशन के दौरान ट्राई किया है वो अगर दिखाएंगे तो बेहतर होगा अभी yes. बना रहे हैं मैडम ओके okay, सर आप बनाइए प्रदीका जी प्रदीका जी आप प्रदीका जी को राइट्स दे दीजिए सर आपने स्क्रीन शेयर करना है आप आप शेयर कर सकती हैं मैम मेरे आप स्क्रीन स्क्रीन शेयर करिए ना मैम शेयर स्क्रीन का बटन दबाइए आपको राइट्स मिल गए होंगे यस यस Press on the share screen button and share the screen you want to show. Mahindra Pratap, sir, we will take your also. Just give me a minute. Now open the app, ma'am. Ma'am, actually, I have created a laptop and I have created a mobile. So, ma'am, you can see the video on the phone and the phone camera through the camera. Camera shift Back view pe camera lagai aur laptop pe dikha dijiye. Jitne ye jitne bache jeete hue the na award winners hain, aaj aaj ke amrit mahotsav ke jitne activity hain. Ye. See, ab ab laptop pe dikhaiye. Yes, we can see it. Very good, ma'am. Yes, ma'am, we can see. Uh, ma'am, uh, Gulshan, ma'am, if you want to add something. Ma'am, it's good, ma'am. But it's different from a different note. It's yellow color, which you have written. You have to connect it too. Maybe somewhere. Yes, online learning with education. Yes, yes. Online learning with education. और मैम इसमें सब कॉन्सेप्ट्स थोड़ा ज्यादा ऐड कीजिए क्योंकि अभी तो ये सिर्फ आपने एक मेन कॉन्सेप्ट कॉन्सेप्ट बनाया इसको एक, आप फर्दर एक्सप्लेन करेंगी ना जी जी तो आपको सब टाइम के लिए मैंने हां हां क्रिएट किया कि मतलब आपको ये तो अंडरस्टैंडिंग बनी गई है कि बनना कैसे है तो अब इसको आप एक्सप्लेन Mahindra Pratap sir, now you can show me. Mahindra Pratap sir. You have made it, sir. Computer, hardware, software. Software operating system. नमस्कार मैम जी मैडम मैंने इसे बनाया है ट्राई के जस्ट स्टूल पे अभी आप इसको और फर्दर डिवाइड करेंगे इन इनपुट जी 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 इनपुट डिवाइस से होते हैं आउटपुट कौन से हैं ऑपरेटिंग सॉफ्टवेयर जी जी और मैं चाहता था कि इसमें कुछ इमेजेस मैं यूज करूं तो क्या मैं यूज कर सकता हूं बिल्कुल बिल्कुल सर क्योंकि अगर आप ज्यादा उसको इंप्रेसिव बनाना चाहते हैं तो ऑब्वियसली पिक्चर्स आप ऐड जरूर कीजिएगा जी राइट क्लिक करके जैसे हमने बताया ऐड पिक्चर करके ऐड इमेज करके आप यहां पिक्चर ऐड कर सकते हैं जहां भी आपको जरूरत लगती है जी जी और सर यूआरएल भी ऐड कर दीजिएगा क्योंकि ये भी सब अभी एब्स्ट्रैक्ट ही है ना बच्चों के अगर आप क्लास में पढ़ाने जा रहे हैं ऑपरेटिंग सॉफ्टवेयर क्या होता है बच्चों को ये क्लियर नहीं होता तो इसको फर्दर एक्सप्लेन करने के लिए आप यहां कोई यूआरएल डाल सकते हैं जिससे कि और एडिशनल इंफॉर्मेशन आप ऐड कर सके अपने कांसेप्ट मैप पे जी 
go to that particular uh, place and then right, give the right click yes ma'am you have to select the node yeah then uh, yes just right click and uh, you can add image and you add url and other information also <clears throat> so you if you already have any saved image then uh, you can show how uh, we can add the image पहले आप सेव कर लीजिएगा इमेजेस आप डाउनलोड कर लीजिए एक जगह सेव कर लीजिए फिर वहां से उठा के आप यहाँ ऐड कर सकते हैं देन इंद्रा प्रियदर्शनी मैम एंड अब्राहम सर गुलजार सर सोनम मैम दे हैव आल्सो रेज देयर हैंड्स वी कैन गिव चांस टू देम आल्सो मैम इस इमेज को कैसा बड़ा करें मैडम इमेज आप एड कर रहे हैं सर जी उसको आप बड़ा मत करिए आप उसको सिंपली यहाँ पे ऐड कर दीजिए वो जब ये आप देखिए जेपीजी का एक ये जो बटन है इस तरह का ये यहाँ क्रिएट हो जाएगा आपकी नोड में जी, जब भी आप इस पे क्लिक करेंगे जी, तो ऑटोमेटिकली वो जिस साइज में इमेज होगी उसी साइज में आ जाएगी ओके ओके तो यहाँ पे तो सिर्फ वो एड कर रहे हैं ना लिटिल इन्फॉर्मेशन यू आर एडिंग बस आप बाहर क्लिक कर दीजिए सर अगर ऐड का आपने कर चुके हैं तो देन अदर पार्टिसिपेंट्स आर आल्सो वेटिंग सर इफ यू हैव शोन योर माइंड वन दैट वी कैन फॉर अदर्स आल्सो जी मैम एक क्वेश्चन है हाउ टू इंक्रीज द थिकनेस ऑफ द एरोस अगेन वी कैन यूज दैट बोल्ड ऑप्शन टू मेक आवर एरो लाइन थिक We are trying. Just select. Ha, uh, just select the. We are trying the... to see the maps, but uh, please, everyone, see the maps of others also. You will find out that whether you are on the correct path or not. It would be difficult for us to see all, but we will see a few only. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Sorry. It's okay. Okay. Ma'am. Ma'am, I mean, Dr. from Puducherry, can I share it now? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Fine. Ma'am, I have she shared. Can you see me? Yes, ma'am. Ah. Just so, uh, the kitchen utensil. Uh, you have shown uh, many week. utensils, but yeah, there is one ladle you are showing. Here, the arrow is going on different direction. These arrows shows us the path. on which we are connecting our sub concept so they should go uh, in one direction also or uh, the these arrow has some meaning also so sir uh, ma'am as uh, i just want to suggest that the uh, make only one direction uh, in uh, the particular direction where you want to show your uh, the information you can just reverse your arrow according to that okay okay ma'am what i am understanding from your mind map is that uh, you are showing the example of kitchen utensil it is yes yes yes, yes. so the arrows are going outwards but oh. this ladle arrow it is going inwards towards the main concept okay, okay. so they should go in one direction okay thank you ma'am thank you तो ओके मैम मैं अपना शेयर कर रही हूँ मैम मैम सॉरी मेरा कॉन्सेप्ट मैप है जी तो मैंने एटॉमिक स्ट्रक्चर के ऊपर बनाया है तो दिस वन इज एटम एंड इसमें सब एटॉमिक पार्टिकल्स के बारे में बताया है जो इलेक्ट्रॉन्स प्रोटॉन्स और न्यूट्रॉन्स होता है और इसके बाद मैंने नीचे मॉडल्स जो स्ट्रक्चर है अलग अलग मॉडल अलग अलग साइंटिस्ट ने जो प्रपोज किया है उसके बारे में बताया है 
तो पहले थॉमसन मॉडल मैंने अभी इसका पिक्चर डाला है क्योंकि उसे वाटरमेलन मॉडल भी कहा जाता है तो थॉमसन मॉडल का जो भी उ, उन्होंने जो भी पोस्टलेट्स प्रपोज किए हैं उसके बारे में इस नोट में मेंशन किया है सेकेंड मॉडल इज रुदर फोल्ड मॉडल के बारे में तो अभी पिक्चर मैंने नहीं डाला मैं डालना चाहती हूँ उसके बारे में उसके पोस्टलेट्स हैं और बोर्ड्स अटोमिक मॉडल जो उन्होंने प्रपोज किया था मॉडल के बारे में उसके बारे में और भी कुछ लिखना है यहाँ पे तो ये मेरा अटोमिक मॉडल अटम स्ट्रक्चर के बारे में पूरा टोटल एक कॉन्सेप्ट मैप है मैम ठीक है मैम अभी कौन सी क्लास के लिए बनाया आपने एट स्टैंडर्ड के लिए मैम ठीक है तो इसमें जो ये मॉडल्स आप बता रहे हैं ना मैम हाँ इनको और थोड़ा सिंप्लीफाई अगर आप कर सकते हो कि ये मॉडल्स क्या है और क्या बताया गया है इस मॉडल में थोड़ा सा सिंप्लीफाइड स्टाइल में या तो आप इंफॉर्मेशन ऐड कर दे या कोई पिक्चर ऐड कर दे क्योंकि बच्चे एट क्लास के हैं ना हाँ। तो उनको थोड़ा आसान हो जाएगा ये मॉडल्स को अंडरस्टैंड करना क्योंकि जहां तक मुझे पता है ये मॉडल्स आठवीं क्लास के बच्चों के लिए थोड़ा सा मुश्किल हो जाता है हाँ, इसीलिए फिर हम कॉन्सेप्ट में आपका हेल्प ले रहे हैं हाँ ठीक है जी वैसे मैम अच्छा है थैंक यू नोट्स में सिंप्लीफाई करके नोट्स में कर सकते हैं जी जी ठीक है मैम थैंक यू मैम ओके थैंक यू यस देर आर मेनी अदर पार्टिसिपेंट्स सोनम बाधवी मैम यूसुफ सर मुस्तफा कमाल सर यस इफ यू हैव राइट्स टू शेयर योर स्क्रीन देन प्लीज स्टार्ट टाइप्स ऑफ सेंटेंस इट इज नॉट कनेक्टिंग टू एनी नोट इफ दिस is the main concept which you are further explaining then you have to keep this text into a note and then you have to connect this uh, no, uh, the the main concept to other sub concepts okay sir okay madam okay types of sentences simple simple and complex acha sentence is the main um, um, yeah this main concept hmm? okay and then you have to uh, just choose a, a, a different color for main concept so that one can identify what is the main concept and what are the sub concepts ma'am on doubt i have hmm yes sir uh, ma'am instead of showing all the concept and uh, main concept and sub concept all at once as we go on explaining uh, can we show some sub concept later can we show some what instead of showing everything all at once madam mm -hmm. i go on the step by step can we hide some uh, sub topic and later on when we uh, explaining the topic can we show it that one that uh, i haven't tried sir till now but surely i will try but i don't think we can do this thing you want to show that uh, whatever information you are showing only that should be visible to yeah. students and right. then when you come to sub concept uh, then mm -hmm. the sub concept will be visible to a student Especially but no point. no we are showing the concept map as a whole we are explaining the topic as a whole to students then i don't think it is uh, possible here but obviously we can try if there is any other option uh, any such option I have actually that feature is there in some of the other mm. softwares like Free Mind and Free Play. Mm. We yeah. can we can uh, uh, you know close the map till yeah. the time we are not going to mm. present. But that's a mind map, and this is a concept. mind map and Free so Mind. I think also we can check yeah. here if mm -hmm. we can unfold it. I did it. that one in Free Play, madam. That one. Yes, yes. Free yeah, in Free Mind also, I think it is like that. In, in both, yeah. it is there. Mm. Mm. Okay. Thank you, sir. I think now we have seen, ma'am, a few maps, and everybody is aware that what to see in a concept map when they are preparing. It was just an idea to explain all of you that how 
your concept map is going uh, where you want to correct it so through these examples you have you might have got to know the overall understanding that how you have to proceed with the concept map and now if you have directly any queries related to the concept map we can take one or two queries and then we can uh, i have sent the link of the set project yes don't sir send here now because that was just a guiding thing and it has been done if you still have any question you can ask while we can use this app how to write in these scripts can we choose hindi ma'am in this if you can just guide upon that i mean other languages sir uh, yes mm -hmm. i have just mentioned that uh, we can take help of google input tool and we can add the language mm -hmm. of your choice in to the concept map as uh, uh, we have shown uh, we have just seen uh, one concept map which uh, the sir has shown i don't remember the name of sir sorry so he has shown us a concept map that is uh, that has been made in the uh, hindi language so obviously we can add uh, other languages also but you can take help of google input tools for that Uh, madam, uh, can we, uh, uh, if you can explain the saving uh, uh, the yes again because there are two three questions for saving the map again so after completing your mind map you can save your mind map and you can choose uh, just uh, allow me few seconds i'll share my screen and then explain it how we can save Ma'am, uh, like uh, image, can we add a voice or uh, video clipping? Ma'am, I think you are mute. Ah, uh, yes. Knowledge. So here is uh, our mind map. Mm. Firstly, I'll show you how you can save it. Simply go to the file menu. Chee. Normally, as you save your files, you can save your uh, mind map, uh, this concept Chee. map also. So just click on save as option. If you sure. want, uh, yeah. just choose the location wherever you want to save it. By default, it will take the extension of view uh, dot view, and uh, under this uh, save as option, you will find the format option. So you can choose the format of your choice as per your need. Uh, where uh, you are using uh, your mind map, either you want to use it in your presentations, in your PPTs, or you can uh, show your mind map <clears throat> in the uh, in this uh, as it is. Also, uh, you can choose. the format as per your choice so most preferably uh, we take the pdf option and you can also select the jpeg format you can also select the png svg rdf it you can take the uh, format option as per your need okay sir so uh, simply the same manner uh, how we save our files we will save the concept map also so i have saved my map on desktop in the pdf format i'll show you how it will look on the desktop after saving
so here you can see this little icon is it visible this my mind map my map has been saved on desktop ma by the ma ma we can't see your desktop we are seeing the only software uh, screen okay then again i have to uh, reshare the screen right now is it visible ma'am yes ma'am your desktop is visible so this little icon which i am selecting by the name new map my mind map has been saved here on desktop and it is in the pdf format only can you see it is opening in yes, pdf form okay so in this manner you can save your concept map ma'am there is one question like image can we insert audio and video also you can add uh, the link of your audio you can try adding the link of your audio in the uh, concept map if we save view it can be edited again so if you are saving it in the pdf format then uh, you won't be able to edit it yes you can print uh, it is very simple to print the concept map you just mail it yourself and print it okay in hindi you have prepare a concept very good so can we see that hindi matlab the concept map binder sir we uh, mama i want to share my own hmm sir the same map you have shown in uh, english language also hey. okay yes ma'am yes ma'am ah uh, good i used the hindi input tools and i mm -hmm. okay great sir great so now the other participants who were asking that uh, can we use other languages also it is very clear the uh, sir has tried uh, the google input tool and added the hindi language thank you sir thanks for clarification uh, Ma I, i want to i want to share my one okay sir yes. you can share but this is the last which we are taking now after that we will close this session please share your screen yes. sir मैम दिखाई दे रहा है मैम जी सर ये आपने बंगाली लिखी है सर कौन सी लैंग्वेज है ये बंगला है हाँ हाँ आपने भी गूगल इनपुट का यूज किया सर जी नहीं ओब्रो ओब्रो की ओब्रो की बोर्ड अच्छा ठीक है सर तो इसमें आप इसको बाइलिंगुअल आप क्रिएट करेंगे जैसे मैं देख रही थी कॉजेज इंग्लिश में लिखा हुआ है या आप प्योरली बांग्ला में ही करेंगे तो आप देख लीजिएगा जैसे आप करना चाहे एक लैंग्वेज में भी कर सकते हैं अभी तो ट्राई कर रहे हैं हाँ हाँ ठीक है सर थैंक यू सो नाउ आई थिंक थैंक यू एवरी वन फॉर शोइंग सच एक्साइटमेंट अमंग All yourself regarding this tool. Monica, ma'am. हाँ जी. Uh, मुझे एक क्वेश्चन पूछना था. पूछिए मैम. Last question ले लेते हैं. Sir, Nitish, please, please sharing बंद कर दीजिए. Uh, Gulshan, ma'am. Uh, 
वो नोड में जब हम टाइप करते हैं तो वो रैप नहीं होता तो फिर हमें एंटर करके नीचे लिखना पड़ता है वो कुछ ऑप्शन है क्या उसमें रिसाइज करने के लिए टेक्स्ट को आप का जो नोड है मैम ये नोड का साइज आप थोड़ा बढ़ा सकते हैं नहीं छोटा करने के लिए छोटा करना है तो फिर आप नीचे उसको एक मिनट आप कह रहे हैं कि वो ऑटोमेटिकली रैप नहीं हो रहा है हाँ ऑटोमेटिकली रैप नहीं हो रहा है मैं एक बार मैम ट्राई करके आपको बताती हूँ अच्छा टाइम तो मोनिका में ज्यादा ही हो गया <laughs> तभी मैं बार बार इंटरव्यून कर रही हूँ ठीक है मैम आपकी इस क्वेरी का आंसर मैं आपको चैट बॉक्स उधर दे देती हूँ व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप है ना हमारा एस आर जी का हाँ मैं उसमें पक्का आपको जवाब देती हूँ उसका ठीक है मैम थैंक यू मैम मैडम प्लीज शो मी वन सेकेंड हाउ टू सेव एज पी डी एफ सर गो टू द सेव बटन देन वेन वी से सेव एज वी हैव अ डायलॉग बॉक्स विल अपियर इन द डायलॉग बॉक्स चेंज द फाइल फॉर्मेट टाइप इन द फाइल फॉर्मेट यू सिलेक्ट पी डी एफ एंड देन सेव ओके मैम ओके सो नाउ थैंक यू गुलशन मैम फॉर दिस वंडरफुल सेशन एंड why this is wonderful is i think uh, very well explained through the questions which participants are asking and how well they are preparing the concept map in the different languages we have seen hindi english and bangla here so it is very heartening to see the participation here the engagement of participants during this uh, session uh, thank you for this wonderful session uh, it was uh, really enlightening for all of us thank you once again ma'am from my behalf and on behalf of all the participants